stone. It's green like blaze, but it's hard and shiny. What I is this? Would be interested. The problem. I'm gonna need my focus. Looks like that dead soldier tried to pry this open, but he didn't know what he was doing. And now the water's not going where it's supposed to. Sabotage. Or ignorance. I don't think this is gonna do anything. The water's still leaking. We gotta try something else. Was that supposed to do anything? I guess not. This must be the pipe that connects to Scalding Spear. Connect. Pipe. It looks like it bypasses the damage distribution system. Maybe I can find a way to reroute the water through it. Maybe if I follow that main pipe, I'll find something useful. What do you need me to do? Just, uh, stay here. Let me know if anything changes. I'm gonna take a look around. A valve. That might help. Hey! It stopped leaking. It looks like that stopped the water flow. Now I just need to find a way to get it to Scalding Spear. I'll wait here, then. That's the same type of machinery we found outside. Oh, well, this one's not leaking. Maybe it can help me switch the water flow. It sounds like the water's switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. Ah! I'm not getting up through there. Is it the wound? What do you see? <laughs> the 
system switched back. Couldn't hold the water pressure. I need to find a way up to that valve. It's leaking again. Whatever you did, undo it. Better close that up again. The leaks disappeared. Making progress? Is it done? Not yet. I'm working on it. I'll wait here then. <laughs> Sounds like the water switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. to find another way to get up to that valve. Is it the wound? What do you see? Sounds like the water is switched. I've got to open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. Sounds like that did something. Aloy, I can hear water in the room again. Anything leaking? Not that I can see. Let's hope that means my plan worked. That should do it. This will return water to Scolding Spear? Checking the wound is the only way to be sure. That fallen soldier. Come with me. I want to look upon the face of the coward who did this to our people. get anywhere near that body with those machines in the way. If there's another cauldron out there that has override data on that machine.
You know him? That... is one of Draka's men. <sighs> I should have known. Draka knew what would happen if the capital was left without water. But he didn't care! All he wanted was to cause a crisis so he could challenge my command. We don't know that for sure. Meet me back at the wound when you can. Please. To make sure the water will flow. I will. Don't do anything rash about Draka. Only an upstart acts rashly. A commander bides her time. Hey. The desert was kind to lead you to us. Going down. I see soldiers guarding the wound in the sand. I need to see the wound. I'm afraid your presence is required in the commander's quarters. Is everything okay? The dissident Draka has been apprehended for interfering with the wound. How did he interfere? He entered the wound by force, saw that it was empty, except for a slow trickle that began when you fixed the device in the desert. He did not take it well. Of course he didn't. I'll go meet with them. You're on. You have some nerve. You're one to talk. Sound good. What? How could you let this happen? How did I let this happen? You're the one who sabotaged the wound in the first place. You're lucky we were able to fix it, or your head would already be on a spear. You call that fixed? It's just a dribble. And it's not my fault. I already told you Ukta came to me. He said he found something in the desert that might get us water. I had no idea it had anything to do with the wound. And you expect me to believe that? Aloy, I came for the water that was owed to us, and when I found out that there is no water, they arrested me. As I already told you, the water is returning, but slowly. It'll be weeks before the wound is full again. Until then, I will send Arrowhand what I can. You hid what happened to the wound. How can we believe you now? Draka. No, you know what? Enough of this! No more words! <laughs> Consider that a challenge! Gather your squads, then, and meet us at the Gate of the Vanquished. I have a challenge to prepare for. Leave me! This will be the end of the clan. I have to stop it. We have to stop it. 
Hold on a second. Help me understand. What makes you think I can help you stop them? I'm not even from this tribe. They both owe you a debt. You aided them when no one else could. And you've seen into their hearts, just like I have. Misguided in different ways, but no less worthy of the people they protect. Your words might be enough to spear some sense into them. Yeah, well, they're not exactly good listeners. And you are no ordinary speaker, especially with a bow in your hand. I will go to the Gate of the Vanquished, southwest of here, to stall them. But without you, I'm afraid we'll run out of body bags fast. If what Jataka says is true, Yara and Draka will end up killing a lot more than just each other. There has to be something I can do. Angry to knock them. Draka and Yara are already here. War or no war, the hunting grounds stay open. You're their commander. You can stop this. She can try. In the name of the ten. You're here. And I thought you didn't care. Aloy, did you come to witness the challenge? Does there have to be a challenge? Oh yeah, there does. If you persist, all of these squads will join the fights. How many will die here? And how many will die in our villages once the retaliation begins? There has to be another way. Listen to what she has to say. You both owe her that much. Is this how you two plan to save your clan? By causing a massacre over who gives the orders? Drop this foolishness and work together. She's right. Put away your spears. Return to your homes. Which means she stays in charge? Forget it. You see? Replacing me is all he cares about. It's a vendetta. And it has to end here. Not for once we agree. Pick a side, Aloy. Because we're settling this now. There must be a way to minimize the bloodshed. The Tanakh never make things easy, do they? I'm afraid not. Becoming commander isn't going to change what happened to the wound, Draka. If you really wanted to help your people, you wouldn't be throwing away more lives just to change who gives the orders. You really are something, Flame of the Desert. But I didn't come all this way to let things stay the way they are. Then fight us. Just us. You want to save lives? Keep your squads out of it. I've seen how you fight. These soldiers are with me. Then we stand with Aloy and Yara. Even numbers. <sighs> Fine, old man. It's your funeral. 
New rules. We're keeping it to just us. Winner takes command. Nice knowing you, Aloy. You should have backed down when you had the chance, Draco. It's over, Draka. <laughs> Not just yet. You did your best to follow the path. You die with honor. The Desert Clan owes you, Huntress. I thank you for all you've done for our people, Huntress. I'm 
getting close to Ether's location. I said it would be in some kind of physical processor. Gala's forces may seem strong now, but her machines took out my entire. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still they stood firm. They didn't falter, and neither will we. Blood of the Ten, you've come to us. You know who I am? Oh. The warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Lai. <laughs> yes. You are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's there's something I need here. Anything you need, the chief will provide. Come. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the Ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the Chief. All right. Let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room, at the far end of the grove. Come. Be welcome among the records of the Ten. Glitched. Incomplete. Joint Force 10 at you. Led by the weapons were only the battle. The ten were dedicated soldiers, working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. Chief is inside. Are you ready to see him? I'm ready. Good. Come. See you soon, Outlander. The savior of Meridian. 
I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta, in single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior, and a man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of Marshal slain. I count hundreds more to knock them whose lives hang in the balance, I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now and taking what I need to save everyone? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Root. I've sent out a call for the competition. Since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. To defend the cool root. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Tecote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit? Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold a cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Katala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. I'll do what you want and go north to deal with Dakote. But you'd better not forget about our deal. You will have what was promised, if you succeed. Speak to Deco on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. Hikaru said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. 
Nothing I haven't faced before. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. Good ether. Guess I'll have to play along with Hikaru. I better meet up with Marshal Catalo at Stonecrest. It'll be faster if I ride a machine. What's this place? to this for later. in trouble. I'm taking you down! Now the tide's turned! Damn machine! Get out of my way! Gotta help my friend. Wait. Slow down and explain. Bate and I were heading south with supplies from Salt Bite when machines attacked. I left her behind so I could get help from the Grove and ran straight into another machine. Thank the Ten you were here to help. So your friend is still up the road, fighting machines? That's what I'm trying to tell you! I'll bail her out if I can. You go on and get those reinforcements. Will do. I'm in your debt.
Sled. Where is the supplies? And the Tanakh soldier. It looks like the Tanakh tried to salvage some supplies after getting attacked. Want to drop them? A running battle? Maybe they can lead me to the other soldier. Tracks from the missing Tanakh. Definitely looks like the other Tanakh ran off this way. Hey! Vita sent me! By the ten that lump made it, I thought we were both finished. Let's clear out these machines!
attack! No time to lose! We got it! Attack! <laughs> you stubborn fool! You haven't let me down yet! Come on over, please. Thanks. If you hadn't shown up, I would have been machine grist. All I did was give your friend here a little time to come to the rescue. Ah, you're full of it. I barely escaped with my life on the road. That I believe. 